Yes. So we're going to pass it on over to him. What do you have for us this morning, Adam? Good morning, Brittany. Yes, a lot still happening over here at Copper Mountain, also known as the Athletes Mountain. The weather has been absolutely gorgeous up here in the high country, so there's no excuse not to get out here and enjoy some of this nice weather. And over here at Copper, if you're like me and you're ready for these chairlifts behind me to start spinning and you want to get ready for this winter season, head over to the Woodward Barn, which is right near Center Village, and they have an indoor facility with foam pits where you can actually ride your skis and snowboards into a foam pit. It's a great place to learn spins and flips, and it's one of my favorite places to be in the wintertime and in the summertime. So get on over to the Woodward Barn, and if you're curious what else Copper has to offer, they've got a mountain roller coaster, which you control your own speed, but I will warn you, it does go extremely fast. And again, we are approaching Labor Day weekend, so they're going to have live music over here at Copper. Also in Dillon, they're going to have live music on a three-night starting on September 2nd and then 3rd and the 4th. So a lot of music happening in Dillon. And it's not too early for Oktoberfest over at Keystone on September 2nd. They're going to be kicking off Oktoberfest. So make sure to mark your calendar for a great Labor Day weekend up here in the high country. And just recently I talked with uh, Olivia over here at Copper Mountain about the Union Peak Festival. Some big names are coming here, including Fitz and the Tantrums, Spoon, Quinn XCII. There's quite a big name. So we're going to talk with Olivia and hear a little bit more about the Union Peak Festival and how special it is right here at Copper Mountain. Union Peak Festival is coming back to Copper Mountain September 8th through the 10th. I'm being joined with Olivia. Are you excited for this or what? Yeah, this is a great event for us. This is our third year of hosting Union Peak Festival and it's going to be bigger and better than ever. And you guys always have some really big name artists and this year you have some even bigger names than last year. Tell us a little bit more. We do. We have Spoon on Friday, Fits in the Tantrums on Saturday, and Quinn 92 on Sunday. So big weekend. That's a big weekend. Love Fits in the Tantrums. The hand clap. That's one of my favorite songs. It gets me pumped up. And tell us a little bit more about the village activities going down. This is one of the first places I ever threw a fly rod. So you can kind of practice fly fishing too, right? Yeah, so Union Peak is the convergence of community, sport, and art. So we have all of those things coming together here that weekend. So we have an art vendor village, so check out crafts, things like that, things to buy um, that are homemade. Um, the sport part, obviously copper, the athletes' mountains. So like you said, fly fishing. We'll have bike clinics and then golf clinics as well. And then, yeah, the music's really the big deal for us. So that'll be the big kicker for everyone. Oh, yeah, and that music is all free. But if you want to kind of get up close in person and do do some VIP things. You guys have a VIP package, right? We do. So yes, everything for the festival is free, but if you really want to kind of up your game that weekend, um, the VIP package is $400 per person, and that really gives you a huge amount of stuff. So free swag with the VIP package, front of stage viewing, happy hour, drinks, and then also meet and greets with all of the bands, which is pretty sick. So oh, That's awesome. I would do that just alone for the meet and greet. And if people have never been to Copper, they're missing out, obviously. You guys have so many great activities here, including the mountain coaster. You've got the rectangle, the Woodward Barn. There's kind of something for everybody. Yeah, we have a lot going on. We don't close down till the end of September, so head on up here, mountain biking, hiking, like you said, the coaster, the barn. Really, there's a lot to do when you're here. And I really like how you guys are including sport with art because a lot of people out here want to get involved with fly fishing and golfing, and you guys are actually providing that service for them, which is great. Yeah, that's the cool thing about this festival. You know, you come out early, you really spend your whole day doing all these activities, and then you get to kick back at night and enjoy the shows. And there's going to be a ton of stuff happening. So what's a good website if people want to get kind of the whole lineup? Head to coppercolorado.com. So I know summer's kind of coming to an end here, Olivia, but how's it been so far? It's been a great summer. It's been a nice and warm. It really warmed up after this cooler spring. So we're just happy to be out here again for another, another month or so. Absolutely. This is one of my favorite places to be, not only in the summer, but the wintertime too. Soon enough, these chairlists behind us will be spinning. I'm looking forward to it. Olivia, thank you so much. Yeah, thanks for having me. Big thanks to Olivia for talking with us, and make sure to get over here September 8th through the 10th for the Union Peak Festival. Brittany, did you get to get out here last year? It was quite a treat. They had AJR, one of my favorite bands, and then I've got more of my favorite bands coming back this year, too, so I better see you out here. <laughs> I wasn't there last year, but I will be there this year, and I'm still waiting on you to teach me how to do a backflip into a pit on the snowboard. When, when are we going to do that? <laughs> Yeah, Brittany, I definitely want to teach you how to backflip. Let's get over to the barn and let's take advantage of that foam pit, right? Because I'd rather land in the foam than on the snow at first. So let's do that one of these days. 
Absolutely. You got it. Thanks for checking in with us today, Adam. We appreciate the copper coverage.